if you don't eat beyond meat i don't want to hear it's not the same if you eat beyond meat you know this torch like it's torch it's nothing it's torch like yeah Welcome back to the channel. Welcome if you're new here. It's Jess and this is Jubilant Gestures. So today we're in the kitchen as you can tell and I'm doing a cook with me, okay? So I'm doing a cook with me um, and I'm so excited about this cook with me. As you can tell by the title, it's a Beyond Sloppy Joe. Yay! So um, I don't have on any pants, so I'm going to try to make sure that doesn't get in the video. <laughs> and I am having some of the Shutter Homes Fruit Infusions in the Sweet Peach flavor. And I have a whole nectarine cut up in there. So let's go ahead and pour some of that on top of those good nectarines. And I'm going to eat that once all the liquor is gone. Yay. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this um, oil on so that we can get that warming up, okay? We're jumping right into it. I actually don't have a, um, I don't have a cutting board, so don't judge me, I don't have a cutting board because I left my cutting board at my old apartment. So I need to get some new ones. trying to make this video for like eight hours now everybody was calling me so I had to be the phone therapist out here in these streets okay this mic is really big y'all see me making a mess don't don't judge Just, please don't judge It looks like that's gonna be way more than enough onion. <laughs> way more than enough onion. This knife is too big for me. We're just gonna try to dice that up as Hey y'all, so these are the ingredients that I used. My onion, my impossible meat, sloppy joe, um, mix from McCormick and one can of tomato paste and I use the Hawaiian buns. You need the Hawaiian buns, period. Hungry, like I'm actually hungry at this point. Like I'm ready to eat. I'm so ready to eat. If that's too much onion for you, I understand, but I like onions, so that's not too much onion for me. Okay. 
All right, y'all. So I think I was so hungry that my mouth went mute. <laughs> so basically, I just was, you know, tossing the meat in the onions, cooking the meat. I uh, went in the cabinet. I added some liquid smoke. That's what I'm doing now. You see, I just added a little, little zip, baby, zip of that. Okay. I hope y'all saw my. What was the last thing I was cooking? The the patty melt. Okay, so that's me putting some black pepper as well. But if you all saw my patty melt one, then you know all of my meat beyond impossible meat i always like to add liquid smoke because it just it just sets it off and gives it that meaty flavoring okay so now i'm reading the pack because i've never made this kind of sloppy joe before y'all let me know in the comments did y'all use like the manwich cans or have y'all ever used this mccormick seasoning pack this is my first time using the seasoning pack because i was feeling bougie you know of course growing up we used the manwich can okay Okay, now I'm getting ready to drain my meat. I don't care if it's beyond, if it's impossible, if it's being on and possibly really a cow meat. Drain your meat. At least a little bit, please. <laughs> Next thing I'm doing is opening my can of, what is that called? Tomato paste, duh. I'm opening my can of tomato paste. You only need one. I'm terrible with can openers. Like, I don't care what kind of can opener it is. I can't work them. I don't know. It's just me. Y'all leave a comment below if y'all can't work can openers either. <laughs> now that I'm done struggling with that can and can opener, here's my pack of Sloppy Joe seasoning. We're going to go ahead and pour that whole pack in there. Like so. And then next, I'm going to go in with my one can of tomato paste. I did kind of put just a little bit of water to get the remains. Like, I didn't fill up a whole nother can of water. But I just put a little bit of water at the bottom of the can just to, like, loosen up whatever was, you know, residue was still on the can. And to, like, loosen everything up between the seasoning and the thick tomato paste. Oh, it's getting sloppy now. <laughs> well, as you can see, it's getting, yeah, getting, getting real sloppy there. Messy and, and sloppy. And now for my secret ingredient of my sloppy gel. Y'all better not tell nobody but God, okay? Y'all see it. Okay, so back in the day, I would have told you to get some potato rolls. But we in 2021, baby. You better get them Hawaiian buns. Okay, and we about to toast it a little bit. I only let mine toast for like two seconds because, as I said in the beginning of this video, I was very hungry. And so the meat and everything was ready. When it comes to sloppy joe, you just got to put it on the bread and eat it, okay? And so the bread was taking too long, and I only let it toast for two seconds, and then I took it out because I was ready to eat my sandwich. Today, we will be having pickles on the side. These are my favorite pickles, the sweet heat pickles. I probably had them on the side of my patty melt too, but these pickles, you need them on the side of your sloppy joes, your patty melts, your whatever you eat pickles with. These are the pickles that you need, okay?
right y'all so here is my beyond sloppy gel with my little pickle varnish and yes it's nice and sloppy okay <laughs> like all of my plating but anyway so let's try it because i'm excited and i'm really hungry i'm i'm really hungry okay i cannot stress that enough I do have a fork. So it won't get too sloppy. Yeah. It's really good. Mm -hmm. That was my first time having a sloppy gel from the McCormick sloppy gel pack. I'm used to the man which can, honestly. I think the man which can is a little sweeter, but since I put my secret ingredient in it, yeah. This came out really good. If you don't eat beyond meat, I don't want to hear it's not the same. If you eat beyond meat, you know this torch. Like, it's torch. It's nothing. It's torch. Like, yeah. Let me get one of my pickles. Mmm. The pickles set it off. Who set it off? But, alright, y'all. Thank you for cooking with me. Give this video a thumbs up, please. If you like it, if you like Sloppy Joe's, if you like Beyond Sloppy Joe's, all of that. I'm gonna end up getting another one. <laughs> I'll see y'all in the next video.